What is up guys, welcome back to another Destiny 2 video, with today's topic looking into the brand new perk called Frenzy, which is a fantastic ongoing perk that will provide you with a constant boost in performance and weapon damage as long as you are in combat. The perk now can be found on the new Season of the Chosen weaponry, and luckily I got one to drop for the bow and tested out how well it performs in both PvE and PvP, and let me do tell you, if you manage to get the role that I currently have on screen, then this weapon becomes abnormally fast. Now, the description of Frenzy is, being in combat for a extended time increases damage, handling and reload for this weapon until you are out of combat. Basically, being in combat, you get a boost in damage, handling and reload speed. You are considered in combat if you do any damage within the last 7 to 12 seconds from the last time you engage any target. This is not limited to the weapon with Frenzy. Dealing damage with any weapons Millies, any form of damage will count as you being in combat, so as long as you don't go 7 seconds without dealing damage. As long as damage numbers appear, even if it says immune, it counts. If you have a weapon with fence in your hands, it has the buff. You can switch to other weapons, but only that weapon will have the necessary buff. You will lose it if you are considered out of combat being 7 seconds without dealing any sort of damage. With this in mind, how does this perk fare? Compared to other damage perks, it's pretty hefty damage boost you get. You get a 20% constant boost in damage as long as you are in combat. So against other damage perks, Rampage, from the first stack you get 10%, the second stack you get 21%, and the third stack you get 33% damage buff. Now if you use Swash, you get 60% per stack at a max of 30%. Kill Clip, you get a max 35%. Moldy Kill Clip, you get a 16.67% per stack, which maxes out at 50%. Of course, this is not even talking about its duration as well. Swashbuckler and Moldy Kill Clip last for around 5 seconds, Rampage lasts for 3, while this one lasts for 7, and you don't even need to be using the weapon. Plus, the extra handling and reloading are great touches, especially on the SMG, sidearms, or even bows, which have okay reload. The perk is in a sense very powerful but simple, as you only need to be in action to make the perk react, which basically means the end user don't need to put a lot of work in just to get the benefits. When you look at the other damage perks, they require you to make sure you get X amount of kills to activate it or do a specific action, while Frenzy only requires you to be in the combat zone and it will stay active until there is no more fighting around. This makes it miles above more useful than anything we currently had, and I can see this being useful in Grandmaster Nightfalls, where you need all the help you can get, and not even be more restricted on time and duration. Unfortunately, its usage is limited down to PvE and PvE only because of the unpredictable nature of the perk activating. PvP scenarios don't tend to last that long compared to its counterparts, and considering how many ways there are to one-shot a player before the perk kicks in, makes using the perk not only risky, but not worth attempting to use in such a sandbox. This is where the other perks like Kill Clip and Vampage come in and are more effective within their approaches. Although they have much smaller durations, they can be activated any time you get a kill, and that is guaranteed as long as you net that kill of course. Overall, I think Frenzy is an amazing perk introduced this season, and if you see any weapon drop with it, definitely check it out as it will provide a massive boost to your weapon's performance. And if you're someone that likes doing endgame content such as Nightfalls, this is something you definitely want to have at all times. So if you enjoyed the video, then please leave a like and a sub, and also follow me on Twitter to keep up to date with Destiny content if you dig that type of stuff, link is down below. But once again, thanks for stopping by, and I'll see you on the next one.